नमस्कार साथियों विलंब के लिए क्षमा बहुत महत्वपूर्ण प्रेस वार्ता है हमारे महासचिव संगठन श्री के सी वेणुगोपाल जी हमारे कोषाध्यक्ष और राज्यसभा सांसद श्री अजय माकन जी आपके साथ इस आने वाले चुनाव की एक सबसे महत्वपूर्ण कड़ी जो कि लिस्ट होती है कौन कौन हमारे उम्मीदवार हैं वो पहली लिस्ट जारी करेंगे अब श्री के सी वेणुगोपाल जी सबसे पहले शिवरात्रि का शुभ कामना आया थैंक यू बेसिकली डेफिनेटली आज वेमेंस का डे है वेमेंस डे है उसका भी हार्टी कंग्रेचुलेशन फॉर दैट ऑल्सो वी आर नाउ ऑन द इलेक्शन मोड आई थिंक कांग्रेस पार्टी विद इन लास्ट टू थ्री वीक्स वी आर गोइंग ऑन अग्रेसिव पाथ ऑन इलेक्शन कैंपेन on one side our leader rahul gandhi ji is doing bharat jodo nyay yatra that yatra now reached gujarat after covering more no, so many states It started from manipur now ending on mumbai on march 17th there will be a mammoth rally in mumbai 17th evening the yatra will be culminated on march 17th we invited all the india party leaders to attend that bombay rally our congress president himself is writing a letter and sending an invitation to all of the india party leaders in this during this yatra you are all aware of that we are announcing lot many guarantees and promises to the people of the country basically we announced kisan nyay passing a law granting legal status to msp in parliament this is the biggest demand from the farmer side congress party is committed to fulfill this promise when india is coming back into power then hisadari nyay a socio economic caste census to give more meaningful foundation to social empowerment and economic justice in the ownership of the nation's wealth and participation in the government yesterday we announced the un nyay one of the biggest guarantee and promises relating to the youth of this country the youth of this country are totally demoralized the way in which unemployment is peaking in this country to address that concern we are very much committed congress party is very much committed india coalition is committed dur bharti bharosa the congress guarantee that it will create 30 lakhs job in central government according to the published job calendar which we have done in karnataka you know that our telangana experience within this 3 months we have given 35000 youths job can you imagine that you can verify the whenever we are promising we are fulfilling that in karnataka also done telangana also done now we are promising that 30 lakhs job will be created in the central government when we come into the power pehli naukri baki congress guarantee a new right to apprenticeship act just like manrega just like right to information just like right to food a right to the right to apprenticeship act is going to be implemented a private or public sector company to every diploma holder or college graduate below the age of 25 apprentice will give get a 1 lakh per year that is 8500 per month the congress guarantee is to new laws to ensure the highest standard of integrity and fairness 
in the conduct of public examination now you can see that every word leaking the examination is the biggest problem in this country the our youngsters are lost their trust in this examinations now we need to rebuild that trust the congress party is giving a new guarantees to ensure the highest standards of integrity and fairness for conducting the examination to prevent the paper leak then congress guarantees to bring legislation to ensure better working conditions and social security for lakhs and lakhs of youth who seek employment every year in the gig economy the congress will create rupees 5000 crore crore plus with allotment spread across all district of the country for a period of 5 years youth below age of 30, 40 years can avail start up funding of their business enterprises in any sector there are these guarantees going to be to the field just now we have reviewed with the general secretaries in charge of and pcc president of this country to have a verification about our war room status our booth level agent status and our booth level work status there we will do spread this guarantees among the people through this bls all over the country now i am coming to the next item yesterday congress election committee had met you know that now central election committee of congress has selected 39 candidates first list of the candidates we are announcing 39 candidates today in which included former congress president rahul gandhi's name is there former chatisgarh chief minister bubesh baghel ji's name is there former cwc member tamaruddin sahu is there that i will leave it out in this list out of 39 15 people are from general category and 34 candidates from sc st obc minorities 24 24 24 24 15 from general category 24 out of 39 from sc st obc and minority 12 people are below 50 years age under 50 years age 8 people are between 15 and 60 61 and 70 12 people are there 71 to 76 7 people are there this is the age status 71 to 76 now i am reading out the names chatisgarh jankir champa sc dr shivkumar dahariya chatisgarh state korba mrs jolsna magans Chhattisgarh six, Rajnandgarh, Bhubesh Bagel. Chhattisgarh, Durg, Rajendra Sahu. Chhattisgarh, Raipur, Vikas Upadhyaya. Chhattisgarh, Mahasamud, Tamaruddin Sahu. Tamaruddin Sahu. Karnataka. Bijapur SC HR Algor Karnataka Haveri Anand Swami Gaddevara Math Anand Swami Gaddevara Math Karnataka Tumkur SP Muddana Megauda Karnataka Mandya Venkatrama Gauda star chandru karnataka bangalore rural dk suresh shimoga shrimati geeta shivraj kumar hasan sreyas patel 
ദെൻ കേരള കാസർഗോഡ് രാജ്മോഹൻ ഉണ്ണിത്താൻ കണ്ണൂർ കെ സുധാകരൻ വടകര ഷാഫി പറമ്പിൽ വയനാട് ഫോമ കോൺഗ്രസ് പ്രസിഡന്റ് ശ്രീ രാഹുൽ ഗാന്ധി കോഴിക്കോട് ശ്രീ എം കെ രാഘവൻ പാലക്കാട് ശ്രീ വി കെ ശ്രീകണ്ഠൻ ആലത്തൂർ മിസ്സിസ് രമ്യ ഹരിദാസ് മിസ് രമ്യ ഹരിദാസ് തൃശൂർ കെ മുരളീധരൻ ചാലക്കുടി ബിന്നി ബഹനാൻ എറണാകുളം ഹൈ ബി ഈഡൻ ഇടുക്കി ഡീൻ കുര്യാക്കോസ് ആലപ്പുഴ ശ്രീ കെ സി വേണുഗോപാൽ മാവേലിക്കര കൊടിക്കുന്നൽ സുരേഷ് പത്തനംതിട്ട ആൻറ്റു ആൻ്റണി ആറ്റിങ്ങൽ അടൂർ പ്രകാശ് തിരുവനന്തപുരം ഡോക്ടർ ശശി തരൂർ ലക്ഷദ്വീപ് മുഹമ്മദ് ഹംദുള്ള സായിദ് ഷിലോങ് മേഘാലയ വിൻസെൻറ് എച്ച് പാല മേഘാലയ തുറ എസ് ടി സാലേങ് എ സംഗ്മ നാഗാലാൻഡ് എസ് സുപോങ് മെറൻ ജമീർ സിക്കിം ഗോപാൽ ഛട്രി തെലങ്കാന സഹീറാബാദ് സുരേഷ് കുമാർ ഷട്കർ തെലങ്കാന നൽഗുണ്ട രഘുവീർ കുണ്ടരു തെലങ്കാന മഹബൂബ് നഗർ ചെല്ല വംശചന്ദ് റെഡ്ഡി തെലങ്കാന മഹബൂബ് എസ് ടി ബൽറാം നായിക് പോരിക്ക ത്രിപുര ത്രിപുര വെസ്റ്റ് ആശിഷ് കുമാർ സഹെ ദിസ് ഇസ് ദർട്ടി നയൻ നെയിംസ് अभी आपके सामने के सी वेणुगोपाल जी ने थर्टी नाइन लोगों की कांग्रेस के उम्मीदवारों की लिस्ट की घोषणा करी है जैसे इन्होंने कहा मैं दोहराना चाहता हूं कि थर्टी नाइन में से चौदह जनरल हैं और पंद्रह जनरल हैं और चौबीस इसके अंदर एस एसटी ओबीसी और माइनॉरिटीज हैं और इस लिस्ट के अंदर पूर्व कांग्रेस अध्यक्ष राहुल गांधी जी हैं पूर्व मुख्यमंत्री भूपेश बघेल जी हैं सी के पूर्व हमारे सदस्य तामध्वज साहू जी भी हैं के सी वेणुगोपाल जी भी हैं तो ये लिस्ट जो है एक मिश्रण है अनुभवी कांग्रेस के वरिष्ठ नेताओं की युवाओं की संगठन के अंदर जो एन एस वाई यूथ कांग्रेस से निकल करके आए हैं उन लोगों की और जमीन से जुड़े हुए नेताओं की और हमें पूरी उम्मीद है कि कांग्रेस पार्टी जिस प्रकार की गारंटी की घोषणा लोगों के पसंद के हिसाब से हम लोग कर रहे हैं हमारे कैंडिडेट्स सक्षम हैं कि इन गारंटीज को राहुल गांधी जी के नेतृत्व में खरगे जी के नेतृत्व में आगे पूर्ण करें अभी तीन न्याय की मुख्यतः बात करी है किसान न्याय हिस्सेदारी न्याय और युवा न्याय युवा न्याय को पांच अलग अलग वर्गों के अंदर भरोसे के तौर के ऊपर कहा गया है भर्ती का भरोसा कि 30 लाख नौकरियां सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट के अंदर हम लोग करेंगे देंगे एक पब्लिश जॉब कैलेंडर के अनुसार एक कैलेंडर बनाया जाएगा और उसी के आधार के ऊपर 30 लाख नौकरियां सरकारी नौकरियां हमारी सरकार में आते ही हम लोग देंगे पहली नौकरी पक्की अप्रेंटिसिप के लिए एक कानून 
मनरेगा के तौर के ऊपर बनाया जाएगा इस बात का भी भरोसा कांग्रेस पार्टी देती है पेपर लीक से मुक्ति इस बात का भी भरोसा कांग्रेस पार्टी देती है गिग इकोनॉमी को सामाजिक सुरक्षा दी जाए जो कि आजकल एकदम से नहीं है नहीं के बराबर है कानूनन इनको सामाजिक सुरक्षा दी जाए इस चीज की भी गारंटी और युवा रोशनी के लिए कांग्रेस पांच हजार करोड़ का कॉर्पेस बनाएगी ताकि पूरे देश भर में युवाओं को का देखभाल किया जा सके तो मैं समझता हूं कि यह पहली लिस्ट अच्छी लिस्ट है आप सब लोगों को शिवरात्रि के उपलक्ष में बहुत बहुत बधाई और महिला दिवस के उपलक्ष में भी बहुत बहुत बधाई Now this is the list uh, decided by yesterday CEC under the presidentship of Honorable Congress President Malligarjuna Karge Chi. We are discussed the, the seats of the states Kerala, Karnataka, Telangana, Chhattisgarh, and Delhi and Lakshadweep yesterday. Next CEC meeting is on 11th. Whenever the next seat is going to be decided. We will let you know the names of the candidates. That's what I'm telling. Wait for the list because of states. No, that I, I, I already answered all that questions. I don't know why BJP sitting MP ticket been cut. That is their business. Our position is very clear. We are going on a clear basis of inability and the loyalty. Sir, sir, Assam for a question. Assam has seen that India has seen that the PMC and the Ahmadi Party. These people are also a little bit outside. So, what can happen here? What is the India Alliance's future in Assam? We are trying maximum possible way. to go with india alliance everywhere but still there are little bit issues like west bengal somewhere in assam like situation is there we are trying to sort it out that issue also congress party is very clear we are here for reducing the bjp seats in a maximum level we are ready to sacrifice anything for that reducing the bjp seats but we are expecting the same level of cooperation with other partners also in some states we need to move forward that's what i'm telling nothing 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 delhi very cordial discussion yesterday ho gaya we are we are searching for the best candidates in delhi our three seat we will provide our best candidates we are exploring all the possibilities of finding out the best candidates Sir. only for the deal. that that is for the delhi not individually indi in, individually i don't i told you brother individually i don't want to answer any seats we are we are giving tickets on the basis of inability and that much because this is this is very very clear it is this is the lok sabha election which is going to be decided the future of this country our target congress party is target to win maximum number of seats in this lok sabha election to eradicate this fascist government that is the target that is the foremost priority that is the answer therefore we are searching for winning each and every seats of congress wherever we are we can have that is the priority we will see more senior leaders contesting no you you senior leaders are this in this list senior leaders are there coming list also senior leaders will be there sir so okay. you believe on march 17 ki all india bloc senior leaders will be there including leaders such as mamta banerjee who are being little bit uh, disgruntled uh, because of how we are inviting all the india party leaders to be there on 17th 
we are expecting because election time also there we are expecting maximum participation of india leaders in that meeting will there be more rallies like that one anyway we already done in patna now it is in mumbai we will explore other places also thank you that only one seat we lost last time